Hey guys, this is week two of our behind the scenes look at the making of Home Diagnosis season two. And we want you to be part of our production team, which you can check out more of at patreon.com slash home diagnosis TV. So episode two is about energy efficiency versus performance. This might raise a couple hackles, but we wanna just make sure that people know, and if you're not familiar with this concept, the goals of energy efficiency and the goals of performance control are not the same. We harp a lot in the show and on this YouTube channel about the 4-3-2-1 approach, right? Four elements are heat bleed, airflow and pressure, moisture and air quality. Moisture and air quality are the two most important things on this list. And so the question is, how do you get both performance control and energy efficiency without having them fight each other? And to find that answer, you can go to patreon.com slash home diagnosis TV and join in on the conversation. And if you don't know the show, enjoy this next little bit from one of our episodes of season one. Coming up on Home Diagnosis. Some things aren't always as they seem. I, in particular, am very sensitive. I can smell the basement. Neo is facing not being believed. There's a cat door in the door. But no cats in the house. We gave up a few years ago. There's a greater problem happening. You have confused spaces in your house. We had to evacuate the house. The basement was flooded. Mm -hmm. It was really a nightmare. It can be a very big deal. All that stuff is very vulnerable, and you're not going to know this unless you scratch beneath the surface. 